Hi everyone, this is Laura Mackey, and this is my very first video installment from my Expanding Horizons series. Today I thought I'd share with you how to save a selection in Photoshop. There are many times when I'm working on an image where I'll spend a lot of time making a selection and I don't want to lose what I've just done. What I'm going to show you here enables you to save that selection and recall it at a later time. So let's get started. Over on the left hand side you're going to make sure that this tool which is called your quick selection tool is clicked. So I see that it's been clicked so I'm going to go ahead and go up here and make sure my plus sign is cl clicked. You have three choices for the quick selection tool but you want to make sure in this case that your plus sign is selected. If you go to the right you'll see the words auto enhance. You want to make sure that's clicked too. What that's going to do is tell Photoshop as you're clicking and dragging to make its best guess as to what selection you want and I'll show you how it works. Go ahead and click and drag and you'll see wow it just sort of guessed as to what the selection was that I wanted and in this case it was pretty spot on. That's what's so handy about having this auto enhance selected. Now I want to save the selection. The way I do that is you go to the top menu and you click select. Then you scroll down and then you click save selection. You'll notice that it put the document name in and then there's something called channel here. It says new. Just leave it that way and then give your selection a name. I'm going to call it sky and then click OK. And that's all there is to it. It's been saved. And I'll go ahead and show you now how to recall it at a later time. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these marching ants because I want to show you how it works from scratch. So the way you do that is you hit Control or Command D. That clears any marching ants that you see on the screen at the time. Now I want to reload the selection that I made and labeled sky. The way you do that is you go back up to the top menu, click select, scroll down, and then you click load selection. Then you'll see here your document name. Then you just have to click where it says channel and oh there's where I saved it. And then you click sky, click OK. And voila, it brings the selection back up. I hope that really saves you some time when you've made a selection and then you want to recall it at a later time. Thanks for listening and I'll see you again soon.